Ladies and gentlemen, your 2021 Iron Bank contract winner is here. Money maker Chris. Always cashed in and you can bank on that. Future so bright I need to wear shades. King of the mics, 2021. You know, the money maker has been very successful when he's entered these competitions. I entered the Promo Bowl last year, and I was one of the winners. I entered the Iron Bank Contract Competition, and I won. And now I've entered the King of the Mic. And I got one guy standing in my way. His name is Ryan Sutcliffe. I've done my homework on you, Ryan. And I see that you got a little show called Ryan Square. And I saw you with your little shades on, your little white jacket, getting your James Bond on. You didn't look as good as the moneymaker looked in his shades, but hey, everybody can't be the moneymaker. But it hit me. It hit me like a sack of potatoes. Why a guy like you would be on a show called Ryan Square. Because that's who you are. You're a square. Like Squint said in the Sandlot, you're an L7 weenie. And I'll be damned if a little punk ass weenie like you is going to beat me in this competition. So you can take your ball and go home. You're not in my league and you're not on my level. I have a goal that's to win. The king of the mic. Walk in the promo slam and to walk out as the promo champion. That's not a spoiler, ladies and gentlemen. That is just a fact of life. With that being said, money maker Chris. Cash in out. Fire the cannons and hit my music. Hey, hey, kids, listen up. Class is in session. <clears throat> I've made my statement in this company very clear from day one, what I intend to do here, and that is take over. And I'm quite frankly insulted that they now tell me I have to go through some money maker, Chris Durham. I don't like that name. I'm going to rename you. How about my bitch, Chris Durham? I think that works suitably well. From day one, I set out a mission, and that was to take over and destroy everyone here at Max Wrestling. And I'm frankly, quite, quite disgusted that they've given me someone pathetic like, like you, Chris, to go through first. I don't want. I didn't come here for the small fish. I came here for the big fish. If it means stepping over you, that's exactly what I'll do, my man. Because you are a twig to my massive beanstalk. That's all you are. I'm just, you know, it's an easy win. You call yourself the money maker. You talk a lot. You talk a lot for a guy that's won a sweet F all here in Max. In my debut, I took the Demon S to school, my man. What have you done? I've looked back at some of your work. And you're not bad. You know Dwayne Johnson. You're more like a... Uh, well, someone from TNA in 2010, really, aren't you? You ain't got nothing on me, boy. But I'm going to entertain it. I'll sit here. I'll talk to you. Because, you know, someone's got to give you the rub, don't they? And if it's going to be me, it's going to be me. You know what I mean? Oh, well, here we are. Here we are, Chris Durham. You can bank on that. That's what you like to say. <clears throat> well, bank on what? What have you done? 
what have you done? When when I got DM'd that my opponent was going to be you, I took one look in the mirror and I thought, this is going to be easy. This is going to be easy. This is exactly what it is. Easy. Because I'm not even... I don't even... You're not even here, mate. My head's on the end game. And that's... The end game to me is the whole of Max Wrestling. Because I am the spark that lights the flame that brings Max Wrestling to the fucking absolute ground.